Welcome to Budget Beauty, where I help you look flawless for less. Welcome back and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen and this is Budget Beauty. We do everything beauty on a budget and that includes lots of subscription boxes, Sephora and Ulta favorites kits, new makeup releases, mystery boxes, eyeshadow and makeup tutorials. And today we are starting kind of a new series here on my channel per your request and that is me ranking eyeshadow palettes. I get asked all the time, what are your favorite indie brands? What are your all-time favorite palettes? Colorful palettes, neutral palettes. Tell us all about the eyeshadow palette. So we are starting out this little mini series with my top 10 favorite colorful eyeshadow palettes. And let me tell you, this was really hard. Really, really, really hard because I have well over 200 eyeshadow palettes. I love most of the palettes in my collection with all of my heart. That's why they've made it through declut declutters and they remain in my collection. So I had to spend a lot of time really thinking about my top 10 favorite colorful palettes. Now you can create neutral looks with these palettes as well, but all 10 of these are going to have beautiful, fun, vibrant color stories. I have mainstream, I have indie, and I am so incredibly excited to share my top 10 colorful palettes. So if you can't wait to see what 10 I chose, give this video a big, huge thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed and your bell notification is turned on because I upload lots and lots of new videos every single week. I will link all 10 palettes down below for you. I double checked and all 10 of these palettes are available to purchase, so I'll make sure that they're linked in the description box, along with my favorite beauty subscriptions, all of the makeup that I'm wearing in today's video, if you'd like to recreate this look. And of course, come on over, follow me on TikTok for more beauty on a budget. So let's talk about my top 10 favorite colorful eyeshadow palettes, ranked from number one, which is my all-time favorite, to number 10, which is still an amazing, amazing eyeshadow palette, but I had to put them somewhere in the ranking. Just a reminder, these 10 palettes are my all-time favorite colorful palettes, so even the palette at number 10 is still one of my all-time favorites, and if for some reason someone stole all my eyeshadow palettes, I would buy every single one of these 10 palettes again. So whether it's number one or number 10, these are my top 10 favorite colorful palettes. So we're gonna start with number 10, which is from BH Cosmetics, and this is the Avocado Toast Palette. This is an absolutely beautiful palette. Now this is one that you actually can create quite a few neutral looks with it, but there are so many beautiful colors in this palette, and the quality of this BH palette is 10 out of 10. I love that you can create looks by the rows because everything's laid out for you nicely in rows if you want a more monochromatic look and all of the colors pair really well together. The mattes are buttery smooth, the shimmers are absolutely beautiful. I want to swatch a few of the shades in the palettes for you so you can get an idea of why these palettes are in my top 10. So we're gonna swatch some of the mattes and shimmers. So I swatched a couple of the shimmers and three of the mattes, I mean, look Look at how beautiful those shimmers are, how pigmented the mattes are. So this top shade is this Avo Cuddle shade, this really pretty white shimmer shade. It's beautiful on the inner corner. I also swatch Haas for that green shimmer shade. And then the mattes that I swatched are Guac, Paprika, and Holy Moly, and again, absolutely beautiful, intense color. The shimmers are incredible. This is such a fantastic palette. Number nine is Nomad Cosmetics American Parks palette. This is an indie brand. It's owned by a family and they are so nice. They have the best customer service and I just love Nomad Cosmetics quality and their color stories are so unique and beautiful. So again, this is the American Parks palette. Another palette you can create neutral looks with, you can create colorful looks with. The shimmers are really good in this palette and the mattes are highly pigmented, highly buildable, which I really appreciate. You can go in with a lighter matte and really build it up with a deeper matte. 
and not have any muddiness. There's very little fallout with these palettes, even though the colors are so incredibly pigmented. So I went ahead and swatched some of the American Parks palette. So the top two are shimmer shades, and then I swatched three of the matte shades. So I went a little bit more neutral with the matte shades so that you can see that you can create colorful and neutral looks. Really, again, beautiful, beautiful colors. I went ahead and swatched this really pretty green shimmer shade here in the middle, and then this more coppery shimmer shade. For the mattes, I went with the purple, the mustard yellow, and the brown. Again, just so that I can show Show you some of the different more neutral looks that you can create and then you can always add a pop of color with the shimmer or take one of these really pretty colorful mattes and pop it on your lower lash line for a really pretty look but the quality of these palettes is so good and you know I love supporting indie brands number eight is lush life from ColourPop. now I have quite an extensive ColourPop collection and I love a lot of the palettes ColourPop puts out they are a very very affordable affordable brand with really good quality. They do dupe themselves a lot with colors, so be careful when you're purchasing from them that you don't already have that particular color or something close on hand, but they come up with some really beautiful color stories, and the Lush Life is my all-time favorite ColourPop colorful palette. Here's the Lush Life color story. It is green and orange with a pop of blue and some really, really beautiful shimmer shimmer shades. Every color in here is very pigmented, very easy to apply and blend out, and the shimmers are very sparkly and very beautiful. So here are some swatches. So I ended up swatching the green and gold shimmer, stunning. This blue matte right here is really my all-time favorite blue matte that I have. It is so pigmented and beautiful. We have orange and then a more neutral brown. So the shimmers that I swatched are Juicy and It's Paradise, and then the mattes that I swatched are this beautiful monsoon, Noni and Eden, just so that I could show you, again, beautiful color story, very colorful, beautiful pigmented palette, and I wanna say that this palette is less than $15. So highly, highly recommend the Lush Life. It is such an easy to use, beautiful, colorful palette. Number seven goes to Ace Beauté, and this palette, if you love green eyeshadow, this is a green eyeshadow palette lover's dream. This is the Tropical Vibes palette from the indie brand Ace Beauté. It is stunning. The grunge of this palette, oh my gosh, it is absolutely incredible. The shades are some of the most beautiful grungy shades of green that I have ever seen. I am obsessed with this shimmer shade, this pop of teal blue, and then this more chartreuse green, Chef's Kiss, beautiful. I'll make sure I swatch those two for you. But if you love grungy green and you want that kind of smoky eye, but with color, I highly, highly recommend the Tropical Vibes palette. This is one that I would run out and purchase the minute it disappeared from my collection. So here are the swatches. Oh my gosh, this palette, when I see it swatched, just makes me wanna put it on my eyes. But I did swatch my favorite shade, that teal shade in the palette. This is just a beautiful gold shimmer. There's that really chartreuse green with a mustard yellow. And this shade down here is like a purpley black, a very unique shade. So the shimmers are Seychelles in the bottom and Rainforest. Those are the two shimmers that I swatched. And then for colors, of course, I had to do Chartreuse, which is the perfect name for that color. Mango, which is this more mustard yellow color in the corner. And then Cave. Now, Cave is that dark, dark, dark shade, the darkest shade in the palette, but it's more of a purpley gray black. It's a very unique, beautiful color, perfect for the outer corner to really deepen it up and give your look some depth. I love this palette. I mean, I need to put this palette on my eyes pretty much within the next day or so. Number six goes to my all-time favorite indie brand in the world, and that is Unearthly Cosmetics. You can see that my palette says Alien Cosmetics. They did rebrand and into Unearthly Cosmetics quite a while ago. I just happened to purchase the Not Normal palette back when it was Alien Cosmetics. And wait until you see this. This is such a beautiful color story. It is perfect for Halloween. It is perfect for a more grungy look with pops of color. There's also lots of neutral options in this shade. I mean, we have a dark, we have a black, a deep purple, a brown, we have a mustard yellow, all of which are more on the neutral side, but then you pair them with these 
beautiful colors like this gorgeous purple, this green, this white pink color. Absolutely stunning. Unearthly Cosmetics, like I said, is my favorite indie brand. Their eyeshadow formula cannot be beat. I mean, it really truly is the best eyeshadow formula I have ever used. And the Not Normal palette, oh, it's so good. So here are the swatches. I mean, they absolutely speak for themselves. We have a couple of shimmer shades at the top and then three of the beautiful buttery soft mattes. So the two shimmer shades that I swatched is Topaz, this really pretty grungy yellowy green and taupe and then four mattes. I wanted to show you color and also neutral. So I swatched Sultry, Emerald and then grunge. Now grunge, that bottom shade, does have a little bit of a purple color to it, but when it's blended out on the eyes, it looks like a very rich sienna type of brown, so a little more on the neutral side as well. But I love that you can have a neutral look with a pop of color or you can have a colorful look with a pop of neutral, but this palette, definitely, definitely pick it up. Palette number five goes to my ABH Norvina, and I think this is like volume, this is volume three. This palette, I use this palette all the time. This is my go-to orange palette. So if I want to create a beautiful orange look, this is the palette I immediately reach for. The colors in this palette are beautiful. It is such a fun, summer, bright, colorful color story. There is a course neutral in here as well, but to me when I see this, this is 1000% a colorful palette. These oranges, I'm telling you, I have used them so many times. I just think that the orange color and formula is so good. They're so vibrant on the eyes. And unlike some of the other ABH palettes, the shimmers in this one are really good. So here are some swatches. This purple shimmer shade is so beautiful. Gold shimmer, this orange is my very favorite in the whole palette. And then I went with kind of a brighter pink and then a more neutral berry tone. This palette doesn't have super fun shade names, but I did swatch again the purple shimmer and this really pretty kind of orangey gold shimmer. This orange right here is my favorite. So of course that's the one I swatched. And then I swatched this bright pink shade right here in this more berry shade down on the bottom row. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Like I said, if you love orange eyeshadow and if you have blue eyes, orange eyeshadow is perfect for blue eyes. This is a fan Fantastic palette. Next up is from Adept Cosmetics. This is another one of my favorite indie brands and my top three brands. And this is the Amit New palette. Adept Cosmetics has beautiful mattes and really beautiful, unique, special shades, shimmer shades, multi-chromes, duochromes. I just did a look with this palette the other day, posted it on my beauty Instagram. I'll put that here on the screen for you if you don't follow me there. And I had so many people reach out and say, do a tutorial on that look. I absolutely love it. I'll try to pop a picture in right here of the look that I created, but I love this palette. There's actually six mattes in this palette and six special shade. So it's the perfect combination to create just a multitude of looks. I love the grunge. There's deep, there's mid-tone, there's some lighter shades, there's neutral, there's colors. And I'm telling you, their shimmer shades, their special shades are out of this world. If you want the best duochrome multi-chromes, it's definitely going to be Adept Cosmetics. Now I want to swatch every single special shade in this palette for you because it's so incredibly beautiful. But I did go ahead and swatch a couple of the special duo multi-chrome shades and then look at the mattes. The mattes are so pigmented and beautiful and buttery. So the two shimmer special shades are both duochrome shades and that is Hather up here in the corner and Nephethys, I think I'm pronouncing those right. Those are those two just really beautiful special shades. And then for the map, I swatched Pata, Imhaut, oh my gosh, these are really hard names to say, and then Amon, and they are just beautiful. Like I said, I've created so many stunning looks with this palette, and every time I think I want something really sparkly and pretty and unique on my eye, I'm always reaching for Adept, and especially the Amet New palette. This one, I have to say, is one of my faves. Next is a palette that actually took me by surprise. I truly didn't think I would love it as much as I love it, and that is the Huda Beauty rose quartz palette. I almost didn't buy this palette. And let me just tell you, this is falling as number three on the list because it is that 
amazing. It is a colorful palette. It is a pinky, mauve palette with some really beautiful duochromes and shimmer shades in here. And I love just the soft looks that you can create, but also those really pretty pink and purple looks. It's absolutely stunning. Every single shade in this palette performs really well. And again, the shimmer shades are incredible. So here are some swatches for you. This first shimmer shade right here is my favorite in the palette. Every time I create an eye look, I use that. You can see that that is definitely a duochrome and may even be a multi-chrome. It is so stunning. And look at the mattes. The mattes are beautifully pigmented. So the shimmer shades that I showed you first is this Cosmic Love. That's that top shade. It is so beautiful. And then I also swatched Blissful. That is a beautiful beautiful inner corner highlight. It's a beautiful all over the lid, lighter shimmer shade. So stunning. And then for mattes, I went ahead and did happiness, which I really love. Aura. And then I did precious. So I gave you a little glimpse of some of the pink shades, the purple shades in the palette. Absolutely worth every single penny. An amazing, amazing, amazing palette. Now, number two and number one were really hard. It was hard for me to decide where to place each one because I love both of these palettes so much. One of the palettes is all matte and has so many more shades than the other palette, but the other palette just has such beautiful shimmers and mattes that I fell in love with it. So I had to put the smaller palette as number one, but coming in, in the second place is my Blend Bunny Blends Palette. Like I said, this is an all matte rainbow palette and I have used this palette so much, I cannot even tell you how many times I've used this palette. Look at this, it is stunning. I mean, it has every single color of the rainbow, neutrals, colorful shades, neon shades, pastel shades, it has everything in it. If you want a colorful matte palette that you can pair with all those special shades that come in the Adept Cosmetics palettes, or you purchase the All I Ever Wanted All Special Shade Palette from Unearthly Cosmetics, this palette, I like you said, I have used so many times. The mattes in this palette are the most pigmented mattes in my collection. They're buttery smooth, they layer and blend, incredible. I love this palette. I actually own every palette that Blend Bunny has put out. I will buy every palette that they put out, but the blends, because it's an all matte rainbow palette, is one I reach for all the time. So I went ahead and swatched a color from just the different colors that come in this palette. This top shade is absolutely beautiful. This is called Submerged, and it is like a teal green. It's so beautiful. Second is the shade Dream, which I also love. Self Love is the third shade, which is a true red matte. I mean, a true beautiful red matte. And then we have Promise and Mama Bear. So we have a pink shade and a more neutral brown. Like I said, every shade in this palette is 10 out of 10. They're so good. They build up so nicely and a little goes a long way. I mean, you can't, I have not made a dip in this palette and I've used this palette at least 30 times. I've used it so many times. On my move from Washington to Arizona, the two palettes I took for the entire two weeks were the Blend Bunny Matte and my All I Ever Wanted from Unearthly. I'll actually link the All I Ever Wanted Volume 1 and 2 because they're both beautiful down in the description box for you if you want to pick up a palette that is full of special shades. I went ahead and grabbed my All I Ever Wanted palette. Now this is very loved. Like I said, I've used the heck out of this palette, but this is all multi-chrome and duochromes. Every single shade in here is beautiful and special. And this is my favorite palette to pair with my Blend Bunny palette because I use this as my mattes, this is my shimmer. And again, this is another palette combination that I wear that I get so many compliments on. Truthfully, these are the only two palettes you would even need because you have all the colorful and neutral mattes you ever want, all the colorful and neutral special shimmer shades that you want. These two palettes would probably fall as the favorites in my collection. Coming in at number one, and this was really hard between this and the Blends Bunny Blend, the Blend Bunny Blends palette, it was a hard decision, but number one is going again to Unearthly Cosmetics, and this is the Lore palette. Look at how stunning this is. This is an absolutely incredible, colorful palette. The shimmer shades in this palette are the best shimmers I have in my collection. The mattes, as always, with Unearthly Cosmetics are buildable, blendable, buttery soft. There are so many multi-chromes. I mean, Serpent, 
Sphinx, and this middle shade. I'm swatching this for you. This is my favorite shimmer shade in my entire collection. My entire collection of over 200 palettes, if I want my, my favorite shimmer shade, is going right in here to the lower palette. So there are some swatches. I mean, the shimmer shades is really what makes this palette go to number one for me. This multi-chrome right here, Sphinx, is so stunning. I'll show you what it looks like in the pan, and you can see that it looks on my hand like kind of a goldy green. There is that beautiful shimmer shade. That's my all-time favorite in my entire collection. And then I went ahead and swatched Centaur, Mentor, and Cerberus, which is the black and deepening shade in the palette. So when I look at Sphinx in the palette, it is pink. When I pulled it up to you and turn it, it becomes that really pretty goldy pink multi-chrome. This shade, Baselisk, in the middle, I love it so much. And out of my like deep mattes, this one, this black, is so pigmented and beautiful and is a true black where you can really deepen up that outer corner and create a smoky eye. Again, you have lots of neutral mattes. I mean, honestly, all four mattes in this palette are pretty neutral. You even have some neutral shimmer shades and then some pops of color. I love it. Love, love, love the Lore palette. It is not a pricey palette for what it is. It's a nine pen palette, so looks are very easy to put together. Definitely pick this up. I can guarantee this will fall into your favorites as well. So those are my top 10 favorite colorful palettes. Well, I guess 11, because you did get a little bonus of palette in this. But if I were to keep only 10 colorful palettes, these would be the 10 that I would keep. And I wanted to share them with you because you can create neutral looks with these as well. But stay tuned because I plan on doing on my top 10 favorite neutral palettes because I've been getting more into neutral color stories, even though I have a really bright blue look on today. I have been loving my neutrals and I can't wait to share with you my top 10 palettes for neutral lovers. So if you enjoyed this video, give it a big thumbs up. That way I know to continue this little mini series here on my channel and make sure you're subscribed and your bell is turned on so you never miss a future upload. Check out the description box down below for all 11 of these palettes, the makeup that I'm wearing in today's video, if you'd like to recreate this look. And of course, come on over, follow me on TikTok for more beauty on a budget. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.